Hey, welcome to another episode of the Masters Movement. I'm John Wellborn, founder of Power Athlete and also 10-year NFL athlete. And if you like what you're going to hear, I want you to go to the like and subscribe button. I want you to smash it, just like we're about to smash the bench press. Mr. McQuilkin, will you please take a seat and lay back on the bench press? Now, I like to teach the bench press from the bottom up. We're going to start with the feet. Mr. McQuilkin's got a wide stance. His feet are going to be firmly placed in the ground. Knees are going to be pretty even with the ends of his toes. Now, obviously, this bench is a comp bench pretty high, so it's going to vary dependent on the bench height. From this position, he's going to go up. I want him to walk his shoulder blades down towards his hips so that we can get a good arch. I should be able to put my hand underneath here. Now, in terms of the shoulder blades, I want the shoulder blades to be kind of neutral. I don't want to overly retract them. Just let them float on that bench. For the grip, we're going to use a modified close grip. I want to use one thumb length off of the smooth. For closer, different close grips, we also do one thumb width. We're going to use one thumb length. For bench press, we might go out as far as this ring with uh, the ring finger. But for Chris today, one thumb length off of the smooth. Once he's in position, I'm going to reach and call lift, lift, and I'm going to give the bar out to him. Now, before he benches, we're going to focus on two things. I want the spot that he brings the bar down to below the nipples above the xiphoid process. As he brings the bar down, I want a nice kiss, and then I want to drive it up. Now, bar path is going to differ for some people. Chris is going to use a slight S curve, or what people call a slight C. The big thing I want to focus on is position on where the bar hits, and then also keeping the elbows tucked at a 45. There you go, and then driving up. What I don't want to see is all of a sudden you overly rotate and the elbows go this way. We want them to go at a 45. You, no, don't do that. The other big one is not controlling at the bottom, dropping it and breaking your sternum. We don't want that. Oh, don't do it. The other, other fault that we don't want to see, lift the feet up, show me the Jim Bro bench. Yeah, no, don't do that. Extremely unstable, looks cool at the global gym, but we don't want to see it feet firmly planted. Another big one, I want to have a good fixed gaze. Make sure you bring the bar down, control it, and as you drive out, I want you to use compensatory acceleration and work on accelerating that bar. That is our bench press for Power Athlete. If you want more information, come check us out at powerathletehq.com. See ya.